The best password is one that a criminal doesn't know. So the best passwords are those that are unique. By unique, I mean that it's not used for any other services or sites or applications. The second aspect of that is that you want something that is actually long in length. So a six character password or an eight character password is really not sufficient. You want something that is at least 25 characters. No, that's a horrible password. It's a dictionary word. Anybody can guess that and probably half the planet uses that as their password. When you choose the same password for everything, you are now essentially extending the security of all of your accounts to all of the various providers, choosing your passwords and making sure that they are unique at every single place that you utilize passwords is extremely important because sites will get hacked, but you want to ensure that your entire world doesn't fall apart when that happens. No, it's, that's not great either. You just added a couple numbers after it. It's still very guessable. A password manager is a piece of software. That software typically has a master passphrase to unlock essentially a password vault. And in fact, most of those tools will just generate just random 100 character passwords. You never have to remember those and you have the assurance that they are definitely unique. Two-factor authentication is utilizing another method to authenticate you in addition to the original method. This is typically a username and password would be the single factor. And then the second factor is going to be something that you have. That is something like a hardware token that you would plug into your computer or an app that you may have on your mobile device to authorize a push notification. Well, you're getting warmer. You have a word, which isn't great, and you added a couple numbers, but you also added a symbol, which is making it a little bit more complex, but still not a great password. Google Authenticator and other Authenticator apps are pieces of software that will uniquely generate a six digit code every minute. The act of logging in is you enter your username, you enter your password, you enter that authenticator code, that six digit code, and the exchange knows that it was you that actually logged in. If a criminal goes to log in, they're gonna enter your username and maybe they have your password, they enter your password, they are not going to know what that six digit code will be. They can try to guess, of course, and they'll probably be wrong because guessing that six digit code is just like guessing the lottery numbers for tonight's drawing. Okay, now we're talking. That password looks like it was generated from a password manager. Hopefully you're only using it um, for one specific site and it's obviously not gonna be something that anybody's gonna guess and it's probably not something you could ever remember either. So you're gonna wanna make sure that you're keeping that in a password manager in a secure place um, and um, yeah.